See if we can get to the bottom of this whole Ken Palco situation. Palco! Hey, Thomas. Seen Palco around? Let me in. Shuffling shit around. Got you some uh, brandy. No, <laughs> hey, dude. Yeah. I think I might actually show stuff for Outer World this year, you know? Right. I can just throw it all out on the front yard because I'm going to have to move the week after it anyway. Yeah. See, that's the shit right there, man. That's fucking genius. About right there, man. Kidding me? Cheers, man. No place to go yet, but you know, whatever. They give you, you know, they give you 60 days to figure shit out. I tried to apply for some food stamps, and they were like, "Well, we can't, uh, we can't get anyone to answer the phone at Macy's to find out that you don't work there anymore." I'm like. Yeah, they closed the store. Everyone in Minneapolis knows that, dude. How hard is it fucking for you to figure that out? Right. Walk over there. It's a ghost town, you know? Right. Just like most of downtown. It's all shut down, you know? Like, Holy oh. shit. What's going on here? Uh, it was an old painting that I had from, I think it was 2000. Yeah. The date was carved in there, 2000. So uh, mm -hmm. this one, I found this painting. I had it upside down. I was using it as a shelf. Right. I mean, it's not, you know, like, I mean, I've been working on these other things and stuff. But these ones are, uh, you know, same thing. Paper, you know, the, that thin gray art paper stuff. Mm -hmm. with some, with some that has kind of a, yeah. Huh? Bird. The Monster Fang Band, if you ever got to see those, uh, those giant sculptures, I made really big ones of these. Like, there's like five of them that are like four foot by six foot. And they, you know, they look like they're in a band. Like this weird, so I was like, oh, the Monster Fang Band. Religious globe. Yeah, there's a couple of them around here. Yeah? But, you know, like trying to do collage in a different way. Like, you know, do I have to just do it flat? Does it have to be a square? What kind of shape could the piece be, you know? Mm. Hey, man, you should really try and sell these at the Art of World. Yeah, I'm gonna have to because <laughs> I might not have anywhere to go. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm over here. We're gonna fucking promote your fucking ass all over. You know, uh, what's his name? Curtis A. Oh, Curtis A. Yeah, look at that, dude. Like, like my name is written in there. Like, I was like, what? How did that get scribbled in there? Like, it's on the actual art. That was at that frame it or hang it place, whatever. Mm. He had an art exhibit there, and I was like, no way. This dude does collage too. Yeah, I'm gonna have to buy that. Yeah, hell yeah. Transmigration of turmoil. Uh, it was, uh, it's the whole the Torah. So the, you know, the scrolls or the Torah handle would stick out on both sides of the box. Oh. You know, then, uh, you know, you pull the, you lift the Torah up. I keep my Jewish uh, mysticism books in here. There's Your Jewish a, mysticism books. Yeah, I try to keep my stuff separate, you know. Mm. It's kind of the, uh, an abstracted idea of, uh, you know, the, like uh, what's we call it Moses's journey up to get the you know the tablets and stuff like that. Oh. That there's you know there's objects there's you know things along the way. Mm-hmm. Stuff and stuff. You know? mm. Yeah, type thing, huh? <laughs> Hey, I'm making a short film about Palco. Just say one thing about Palco. I adore Palco. Isn't he the best? I do. I adore the man. Ah, Palco, one of the most unique individuals I've ever met. Uh, 
Um, I think it sucks because it's kind of sad to see uh, people get gentrified out of uh, this neighborhood. These were going to be seven stories, you know, like these were going to be several stories tall. These things were going to be like giant. Yeah. You'd go there and stand oh, yeah. there and you'd be like, fucking what the fuck? You know, yeah. This is, you know, it's kind of a hanging garden of Babylon or something nuts. I mean, I really wanted to build some shit. Mm -hmm. He's probably going to have to go back to New Jersey and live with his parents. He's getting out price. I've kicked him out of here a few times, I tell you that. <laughs> <laughs> the Northeast is getting expensive, but there's, there's places around, you know? Yeah. You got to move out. That's, a lot of our regulars have moved out of the neighborhood, you know? Right. You're basically in your town. Yeah. Is he great? So you're going to. Gonna go over to his house on Art World and check out his paintings? I will if he still has his house.